exciting world of hip. Good morning. I'm Andrea Jackson with your Daily Buzz Wake Up Call for Wednesday, November 28, 2012. Was Yasser Arafat poisoned? Forensic experts took samples from the late Palestinian leader's remains and are trying to determine if he was murdered with the hard to trace radioactive poison polonium. Samsung is facing a new patent battle, this time with Ericsson. They've been locked in a nasty, lengthy court battle with Apple over the use of phone and tablet technology. Word has it CNN will soon have a new leader. Their new guy, the current EP of Katie Kirk's talker and the former head of NBC Universal, Mr. Jeff Zucker. The third guy who claims he was in an inappropriate relationship with the voice of Elmo plans on releasing a memoir all about his kinky underage tryst. Oh boy. The half star of Two and a Half Men, Angus T. Jones, has apologized for his comments calling the sitcom filth. We'll see if he ever eats lunch in that town again. Dancing with the Stars, All Stars crowned reality celeb Melissa Rycroft the winner. She and partner Tony Davaloni were thrilled they were the only pair in the finale who hadn't won in their previous season. And the Powerball jackpot has reached $500 million and counting. Who will win the half billion dollars in prize money? One in $175 million has a chance. It's your Wednesday morning wake-up call. <laughs> I'm Andrea Jackson. I'll ring you in the morning. Thank you.